This is the Kinect Smart Ring, the Star Moon Zen 2 made of silver. Since I got mine, I've been wearing it daily for quick payments while traveling or making contactless transactions. I even got one for my wife this time so she can also enjoy the upgraded quality of life. To use it, just align the ring parallel to the surface for payments or unlocking access. If lost, you can always disable and enable it via using the app. If you're unsure about the sizing, the website offers a free sizing kit to ensure a perfect fit, which looks like this. So rest assured, you will get it right. Today, I'm featuring this ring again to celebrate Knick's new app launch. So let's dive into it and check it out. So if you were to check out what's inside the Star Moon Generation 2 package, if you open it up again, we got the Knicked uh, logo sponge protecting the uh, Star Moon Generation 2 ring. And I actually ordered for a white stripe this time because I thought it's going to look cool. And indeed, it's quite nice actually for female use for my wife. And if you look carefully on the inside of the ring, you can see Knick logo and it says 0.94 percentage of silver. So it's almost pure silver. But because of this white band here, it's not. And it's a really good quality silver indeed. Now, inside of the actual package, we got this sort of cloth, cleaning cloth, which has a Knick logo on it. And below that, we got the limited product warranty card. Okay. And then below that, we got the Knick ring guide which is to help you to make payment QR code and also the specification and also the ring care as well. And lastly, we got Knick Tesla key guide as well, how to actually set it up for your Tesla and even Hyundai car as well, you can use it as well. So the Connect app is installed on my Galaxy S24 Ultra. So if we were to click on it, it actually says seamless payments access and beyond so if we were to press on that it says you can either type in your email address to register or use the google account so after selecting which country you reside on for me it's going to be united kingdom it's going to show you which options are available in this country it's curve for either credit or debit card or moon rand or on limit so moon rand and unlimit is for master cards while as curve is for credit and debit card uh, so you can connect your payment card or if you don't have a supported card you can actually choose this option or you could skip it for now if you don't want to so if you press the connect the payment card option this is what's going to show you so you need to connect your ring to your smartphone by placing it around here for my galaxy s24 ultra and I sense a bit of a vibration there. So if we were to rotate it, you can see my uh, Knick ring is now connected to my app through my smartphone, okay? So you can either connect your card by pressing the add card here and there's more feature by pressing here. It says that you can actually link it up with your Fidesmo link, which is very useful indeed. And if you press the three dots on the top, that means you can actually remove your ring as well. So if you were to press the connect card, it says next step, and then you need to type in your email address. After you type in your email address, it's gonna ask you the payment card details. So the long card number and the expiry month and the year, and also the three digit on the back of your card. So I tried both the Barclays credit card and the American Express, and it seems like it's not letting it happen. So I think we've got to go through the Fidesmo option as an alternative. So long story short, because Barclays or American Express is not user friendly with this app yet, you need to get a converted bank details from Curve app here and type it into the app. So it's all ready to go. And then you just need to agree with all the terms and condition and click on yes and wait for the processing. And then it's all good to go. So you just need to place it here and hold it on. And it says step one to three. And then this, just leave it on. Step four and wait until it goes up to step 10. And then your bank details which is technically your Barclays, 
should be all registered under the system. All right, so Curve is gonna send you a six digit activated code, which you need to type it in and you're gonna get a message as successful. So it's all good to go for the payment. So in results, you can see the Curve card actually has been shown on the payment page of the card payment, which has been converted from your Barclays card number. Okay, now if you were to go to the main page again and click on more features, you can also add a uh, Fidismo link into your ring as well. So if you want to add here, you go to next and then you can actually type in your URL address, for example, YouTube or your Instagram or social media or your business website and so on, which is very useful indeed. Since this ring is going to be used for my wife's personal use, I actually copied and pasted her Instagram page URL link on it. And if I press next, it says connection needed. So what you need to do is place it on the back side of your phone until you actually sense this vibration going on. It says hold on. Um, so it says step one and two, and it's going to take a bit of a while. So let's hang on to it for a while to see if it works successful. So this is all set and you just need to press continue and it's all done. So again, let's say if you can't find your ring or if you think someone stole it, you can always go into the Knick app and then click on this and you got an option of saying pause payments or you can actually remove the card. So now it's all set up. Let's actually try this on, on my wife's finger. So it actually feels like I'm making another proposal to her for marriage. And as you can see, that's how it looks like. It's really nice, isn't it? But it's a shame that it doesn't fit onto this finger, but rather the odd one. Anyhow, let's try out to see whether it works. Okay, so let's try that out again. Very good, it works. Okay, we're about to buy a cheese string and use the contactless payment. Please tap or insert your payment card. It's all working. Payment accepted. Thanks for shopping at Tesco. So moving away from previous Fidesmo, Knick has now created their own Ocean Blue branded app, which certainly looks much better and now has continuity on it. It's a shame in the UK, you still have to use Curve information as a converter to be able to register your card payment details, which some might find this initially quite tricky. But once registered though, you no longer need to worry about it. So it should be all good from then onwards. Again, I know this is a very early stage for the app development, which I am honored to be one of the first few who have the privilege to test it out. But the main core of bank detail registering on the curve and adding website works flawlessly. So I would say they have indeed did a great job on it. Personally though, it would be really nice if we can add the American Express details on Knick Ring, but it feels like a rather complicated matter that all related party really needs to agree upon, which could take rather long period of time to get it resolved. So I hope this video showed you how straightforward Knick app works, but if you have any queries, please do comment below. And thank you very much for watching this video. This is LJP Tech. All the best. Bye-bye.